Hey guys, I'm Josh from Lazy Acres. Thank you for tuning in. We are saving the world here one trailer at a time. Today I've got one of my favorites. It's a 2021 Reflection 367 BHS. We did a 2020 video. We're gonna freshen this up with a 2021. A couple small changes, but still a beautiful trailer, guys. This thing comes in right on 12,500 pounds. Four slides, mid bunk area, opposing slides in the back. Very, very nice. Let's get after it. Right here at the front, we've got ourselves a front fiberglass cap that wraps right around the corner. Gives us a really nice positive seal. A standard pin box right through here. LED lights here that's gonna light up this so you can hook up at nighttime. We have a rougher style storage up there in the front. Uh, our battery goes in there, our sewer, our blocks, those kind of stuff. We've moved the, uh, the auto leveling controls right to the outside here so it's nice and easy to uh, you know be operating that while you're hooking up to the truck. We do have the barn style doors here. In behind this side though, we have a uh, 30 pound paint tank on this side, 30 pound paint tank on the other side. Why the barn style is so nice is usually you have the door that opens up to about here and if you're like 18 feet tall like I am, it's really hard to get underneath here. Um, just kidding, but, but that makes sense. It's just nice and easy to get in here underneath the slide. We got blue LED lights right there. So you're not gonna whack your head on that slide at nighttime, at least that's the plan. Big pass-through storage here. Uh, up inside on there on your left, you have your warm control. You can actually tee into that with your phone, operate your slides, maybe some lights, those kind of things, right off your phone and, and uh, nice, nice and easy there. Outside shower here, uh, your winterizing from here, city water connection, outside receptacle, gate valves, uh, what do we call that? We call that cable. Cable and satellite in. Nice light here as well. That's motion sensitive. Bingo, bango. Furnace vent. Six gallon gas electric water heater. Schwintech slide on the the mid bunk and the uh, the bedroom slide there. And then rack and pinion slides on the on the lower level bigger slides. What size tires we got here? We got 16 inch tires, eight bolt hubs, Goodyear endurance tires. That's new for 2021. That's a nice update. And then get a load of this Morai suspension. The Cree 3000 down in through there. The 3000 actually has three inches of travel up and down. Really helps with the chucking overall. Then we have our fridge vent, fridge vent, range hood vent, kitchen window. It's a slider. It's going to allow for a lot of airflow. Uh, we have a sewer hose holder down here in the back. All right, that's nice. We don't have a bumper on these because they have a rear hitch. So that's actually where you're gonna store your sewer hose. 50 amp service. Uh, then we have our hitch here at the back with hooks. We also have lights. Where are the lights? Oh, they're there. Sorry, they're right there. Uh, roof ladder, get up on the roof, check your seals. Get a load of this back window here, guys. Don't, notice that's a sliding window. Think of all the airflow you're gonna get through there in your living cabin. Um, down the door side, got a couple more sliding windows. Secondary awning off the main slide. Outside TV hookups right through here. Another couple windows on the door side of the trailer. Uh, our main awning starts right here. All right, uh, it goes all the way forward. You can imagine, this is about a 40 foot trailer overall. At least 35 of it is covered in awning space. Very, very nice there. Three step entry. There's another blue LED light here. That's gonna light up your stairs at nighttime, making it nice and easy. And then we have some more storage here, a two cubic foot electric only fridge, space here to put another fridge if you want, plug, ice maker, whatever you want to do in through here, that's nice and slick. And then have a look here at the other side of our pass through storage. Right on guys. Let's go inside. Right on guys, we're inside the Reflection 367, diving right in here. Front wardrobe closet, look at all the shelves and action going on in there. You got your washer dryer prep, basically like a side by side action. Uh, you know, washer on the one side, dryer on the other. Hanging compartment here as well. This one has the optional queen. You can do a king or a queen here. With the queen, you get the bedside tables, which is probably what I prefer, but whichever. You got windows there on both sides of the bed. And then coming towards the door side here, get yourself a little bit of a dresser. Seven drawers here built, built into this dresser. Some overhead cabinetry here. Right on, good work. And we do have a spot down here. You can put a uh, TV here for your bedroom. We do have roller shades all throughout here, guys. Nicely blacken the you know the bedroom out, the living space out. That's uh, oh, we have a second AC on this one. That's an option. It's on this guy. Second AC up in the bedroom here. Uh, heading down the hallway into our washer. Grab us a porcelain toilet. Give the old squat check. Feels pretty good. Lots of space. Living closet or living shelf. Closet up through here. Shelf there. Very nice. Uh, fiberglass seamless garden tub style shower. We've got a seat we can sit down. Space here above my head I can turn around, all that kind of good stuff. 
I feel like the sink's bigger for this year. Pretty sure it was a stainless steel, kind of smaller sink last year. Nice uh, seamless countertop, medicine cabinet, right on. Storage here, and then three drawers here down below. Bingo, bango. Good footwork, cameraman. Coming down the hallway here, we got some ladder stairs kind of action here to get up and in the loft. Uh, we got a bunch of lights in here. We got a vent. We got a window in the loft. It's not going to feel claustrophobic up here at all. Uh, very, very nicely done. Look at how well this mattress fits in here. It's exact. Like the mattress couldn't be an inch smaller and an inch bigger. It's perfect in there. Awesome. No carpet on the stairs. No carpet in the hallway. Coming down the hallway though, into our mid bunk den area. Really good flex space here. Uh, we got ourselves a trifold sofa that's going to turn into a bed. Two adults can sleep on there pretty easy. Uh, we have a desk in through here if you want to do some work. A uh, spot there for a TV if you want to do that. Look at all that storage in there. Bigger drawers here down below. Okay. Out of the living space here, or out of the, the, the bunk room, into the living space. Opposing slides, very nice and big in through here. Uh, yeah, this is, this is pretty awesome. This is why you do the mid bunk action. We got ourselves a 12 cubic foot gas electric fridge, oversized microwave, three burner stove top with a separate oven down below. We got ourselves a digital display down here too. It's actually gonna tell us what the temperature is in the oven. Big wide drawer, bunch more drawers down here. All right, solid surface, another cubby right there. Good work. And we're into our uh, island kitchen. Again, solid surface, one big farmer style sink. Pull out faucet on that, uh, you know, faucet there. Then there's a bunch of storage here down below. Okay. And then three drawers built in here. Get a load of this fireplace. That is very, very nice. It's gonna put out some electric heat as well. Get a load of this drawer there. Goodness gracious, you can put a body in there. TV across from the theater seat, built in DVD player. Cupboards are here above. All right, this is nice. They actually have a plug in through here. You can plug your receiver in, run it down through the bottom, pop it up to the TV. Nicely done there. Trifold sofa behind me. This is going to pull out into, again, another bed. So I think it's a little bit wider, though, than the one in the bunk room. And then we got all this overhead storage here. <clears throat> all right. This is what I was talking about on the outside, guys. We got ourselves a sliding window. Sliding window over there. Sliding windows here. It's going to make for a lot of air flow, air flow in this trailer. Uh, theater seats, heat massage, manual reclining action, storage here above. Uh, we should have unwrapped these chairs. But basically, we do have two chairs here, a bunch, of, a bench on that side, and then there's a little bit of storage here built in to the uh, the freestand table and chairs. Uh, let's switch spots. <clears throat> Our pantry on this is awesome. First off, we got some open stores there above. Pop that down. These handles here are new. Look at that pantry space in there, motion sensitive lights, all kinds of covered space in through there. Right on. Hope you guys enjoyed that. That was a 2021 Reflection 367BHS. Like the video, subscribe to the channel. You can email us here at sales at lazyacres.com or you can call us at 705-833-2539. Have a good day.